Hello, my name's Paul Bates. I'm one of the directors of a company called Clean Kill Environmental Services Limited. We're a pest control company. Today, we're gonna to try and help you with some of your pest problems around the house. Now, rats, very few pests cause as much concern, particularly amongst the ladies, as rats. It's often the fact that the tail is bald that seems to scare them. They actually make very good pets, the domestic rats. However, when they get into your house, it's a different matter. They'll start chewing through cables, electric wiring, they gnaw at wood. However, unlike mice, they don't actually like to be in your house. And you'll normally find the entrance points outside where they'll be running around at night. Look around the outside of your house if you think you've got them, because you'll often see the burrows where they're digging out. The first thing to do, get some poison down into those burrows and then seal them back up. After a while, if the burrow stops being reopened, you know you've taken care of them. Now other places to look is always around the garden. In today's society, we're using compost bins. And of course, we're putting fresh fruit that's half eaten out into the compost bins. And that's the sort of thing that will attract the rats. You'll often see them burrowing underneath sheds in the garden. Again, the same methods need to be used. You really do need to use poisons. You're not gonna get rid of them by scaring them away. You need to put poisons down into these burrows and again, seal the burrows up. If you think they are getting into your house, you need to look for broken air bricks, large gaps underneath doors around door frames. Um, if you've got something like a basement, then go down into the basement because it's often an area that is quiet, undisturbed, and that's where you'll often find them running, particularly in properties that are terraced where they may be coming into a house three or four doors down and coming along into yours, particularly if you're storing some food down in your basement. But rats, they tend to be in smaller numbers than mice. Therefore, once you have dealt with them, it's quite often that the problem will have been dealt with completely until the next time because the compost bins will continue to be filled up with fresh food.